everyone and welcome back to the Zelda Timeline playthrough. Today we're heading back to Death Mountain as an adult and running some errands along the way. <laughs> Giving like a concussion is always a great way to start the episode. I'm just gonna trespass near Ganon's castle and go ahead and get the gold scatola. Well, that's definitely out of my price range, considering I can only hold 200 rupees at the moment. Not sure if something terrible happened here or if that's just Ganondorf's idea of home decor. Hey. Now that my miscellaneous hey. errand running is over, hey. time to go to this mountain. Hey. Time no see, Mr. Not Black Spider. Good to see you again after seven years. Hey! 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 
before I go in, I'm gonna check out this grotto. I'm pretty sure it's the Song of Storms one. Might as well catch some bugs when I'm down here. I'm gonna go on a future episode, go back in time, and then plant all the bugs for some tolas and do the bean plants and the same stuff. Before I go to the fire temple, I have better priorities. I gotta squish that spider before everyone comes back. need to grab some bombs. Y'all can't see it on the screen, but I'm down to one. You know, I really have questions. Why do Grons have nipples if they supposedly hatch from rocks? It only looks a little bit toasty in there. I'm not sure why we need the heat-resistant tunic.
Pretty sure I have to get the Megaton Hammer for that, but just in case the Black Radius was off and it's not, so we're gonna have to do the Fire Temple first. Now that we're here, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this episode off. Next time I'll see you guys at the Fire Temple, and thank y'all so much for watching.